Hey guys, Tech Adventure with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're gonna show you guys how to set up a hotspot on your iPhone 13 Pro here or any of the 13 lineup on iOS 15. This method will work on any devices. Essentially, that's uh, iOS 15 and above, and that's gonna be your iPhone 6s and above. So it's really straightforward. First thing you wanna make sure before you can set up a hotspot is that your carrier supports that. Big carriers like T-Mobile, AT&T, Verizon, they all have hots, uh, hotspot enable and you wanna make sure your account actually has that. A lot of times it might not be set up, a feature that you might have to call in to get and it might char charge you additionally. So that's gonna be the first thing that you wanna make sure your account actually has the capability to have cellular hotspot. Cellular hotspot is simply just like Wi-Fi in a sense for other devices to get data through your plan carrier. So the, the, after you know that you have that, you wanna go ahead into your iPhone here on the 13 Pro year, go into settings and simply once you're in settings, of course, make sure that your SIM card is in there and the phone is activated and all of that beforehand. And so you know that you're gonna see in the setting, there's an option for personal hotspot. In the past, it used to be just hotspot, cellular hotspot. It's gonna be slightly different, but essentially you're gonna look for the word hotspot in it. And sometimes you might also see it under the cellular option where you see personal hotspot. So the both ways are gonna be pretty much relevant and accurate. So either way you can do that. Once you do have see that, now what you're gonna to want to do is actually turn on this option to allow others to join. So if you don't turn this on, you won't be able to join. And then you'll see there's a password for it. It's called Wi-Fi password, but it's essentially just the password that when the other device joins, it's gonna to need to enter that password. Of course, this password is really long and you can actually make it smaller. Let's say we want this password to be really simple. So it says here it has to be at least eight characters. So of course, we gotta have to meet that requirement, but of course make it more complicated than password here. I'm just doing this so you guys can see that demo. So we have password here. Now we wanna go ahead and look for this device on the other uh, other one. So here, as you can see here, we're connected to a Wi-Fi here, but we're gonna be looking to connect. As you can see here, iPhone 13 Pro comes up here and the hotspot indicator is that icon that you see right here. You see that? two sort of uh, circles, like a chain, that indicates a hotspot instead of a Wi-Fi. Now we're gonna click on that. Once we click on that, it's gonna ask for our password. So we're gonna put that password. Of course, again, make this password more complicated than that if you're gonna be doing that. And then as you can see here, now we have this mode on for low data mode. Now you can also activate this maximize compatibility, which will pretty much just, uh, for the internet performance, it will be reduced, but it will allow it to be uh, compatible most. So that's another option you can do, but this will work. And once you are using that hotspot from your plan to your another iPhone or another device, you'll see that sort of same thing, chain looking icon up top, and that indicates now we're using hotspot on this device and it's good to go. So hopefully this video is helpful for you guys understanding how to set up enable and activate hotspot and join another device using your hotspot. Thanks for watching guys. Uh, and if this video is helpful, please make sure that like and subscribe button. See you guys next time.